It's hard to believe that it's already been a year since my very first Purple Mattress review. I know, a year has gone by, and I know it's gone by because I just made my final payment, 12 months interest-free Purple Mattress. So this review, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna walk you through my experiences over the last year, let you know what's up now, then we'll wrap it up. Let's get started. This is Jeff with Jeff Reviews For You. My channel is dedicated to reviewing mostly as seen on TV items. I look at some consumer gadgets, other household items. Once in a while, I do a little bit of a DIY just because I like to. If that interests you, I would love it if you would subscribe to my channel and click the bell below. That way you're notified every time I release a video just like this one. One more thing, don't forget to check down the description for my social media, Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. I would love it if you would follow me there too. I just took delivery of my purple mattress and you know how you have that sense of excitement or anticipation? Well, then it gets here. I want to show you something I was kind of disappointed in. This thing is disgustingly filth filthy. Look at this Clorox wipe all over this bag. You know how you like, you're looking forward to something and the guy's like, Hey, just so you know, these are covered like this when we get them. Um, the guy was real nice when he delivered it, but that was kind of frustrating that this thing is just nasty after unrolling. The bed, I have this now vacuum sealed, now to cut it open and see what happens. Wasn't that pretty sweet? Here it is. Dun 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 dun. Dun 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 dun. Purple! King size mattress. Alright, so let's just look at this real quick. It's got this nice textured top, right? In here is the purple grid. I have the purple three, as you saw. So it's three inches of that purple stuff all the way around, except for the very border here. This border about, I don't know, five inches is not part of that purple grid. But here is the first look. Let's put on the mattress cover that came with it. All right, so this protector fits on really tight. I did want to show you that this is a, a stretchy material, which is pretty cool and fits snugly on the mattress. I really like how the sheets tuck under there really, really far so they're not gonna pull out in the middle of the night. There's nothing worse than when the sheets pull out and you have to tuck them back in. So great thinking purple. So it's been about one week since I started using the purple mattress. And I'm gonna be honest with you, my neck is sore. So I'm trying to think about the differences that have happened. One, I got a new mattress, right? And it definitely is comfortable but I also got a new pillow. This is the purple, the tall, 7.5, and I've been using the 6.5, so I'm thinking maybe this is too tall for me, so I'm gonna switch back to the 6.5 to see if that helps, because I definitely feel a strain in my neck, like this pillow is too tall for me. I just wanted to give you a one week into the Purple 3. It's a comfortable mattress, definitely worlds better than my last mattress that I got rid of, but I'm still waiting for that complete comfortable feeling and maybe not a sore back or a sore neck. I'll keep you updated. So the next day, right after that scene was shot, I went right back to the 6.5 inch purple Harmony pillow. The 7.5 inch was too thick. Now I liked how wide it was because the 6.5 is smaller, but the 7.5 was too thick for me. Now let's get back to seeing how things went on my journey. I noted in week one, my neck, and week two, my I could feel different pressure points and pain in my back. Nothing that I couldn't tolerate. It didn't immobilize me. I just had to move a little bit, and that's just something I had to deal with. By the end of week three, and that's where I am right now, I am enjoying this mattress. And it's funny because I don't know if it was psychological or what, but once I read 21 days is how long it takes to acclimate to a new mattress, I was checking the calendar. What day is this? Is this the 19th day? 20, 21 days and it feels better. It's really funny. Um, it could just be all in my head. I don't know. But I just wanted you to know that over this process, it has gotten better for me um, and I really do enjoy this mattress. We are going to skip ahead to the six month mark because things went really well. But then something happened. Let's find out together. I know what you're thinking. Why does Jeff have all those water bottles on his bed? He has lost his mind. Well, I'm gonna show you a way to test the dip in your bed, or at least how deep it goes. They'll call the water bottle test. And all it is is you get some gallon water jugs and line them up and you can actually see the dip in the mattress. 
And I'll just show you that I didn't push these down. This is just the way they went. Let me go adjust them. All right, so they're all lined up. And it's hard sort of to see. You can sort of tell that there's a dip in the bottles here. But let me show you when I put this piece of wood across. There, I got the bottles to uh, cooperate with me. It is kind of challenging because they tend to want to fall over. But you can absolutely see an inch to an inch and a half gap right here in the middle. On the end, it's tight. And in the middle, it's not. And even going down to this side, it looks like it's going to start to dip again. But you know what? I don't have enough water bottles. There you have it. During the first six months, and it's actually right there at the six-month mark, my mattress developed a terrible indentation. They call it a body dent, and it was greater than one inch. I remember waking up one morning thinking, man, my back is so sore. I can't do this. I don't like it. I'm not sleeping on this bed anymore. I immediately emailed the company. They got back to me and said, all right, if you want to file a warranty claim, we need three things. One, send us a picture of your entire mattress. And that's why it's important to have a mattress pad so the mattress still looks protected. Two, send us a picture of the, you know, that tag that you're not supposed to tear off mattresses. They wanted to see the made or the created date. And also send us a picture of your base. And that's important too. I happened to purchase the purple base to go with the purple mattress. Um, and I sent those things to them. And then we'll see together what they did for me. Now that I've hauled away my old purple mattress, you ask yourself, now what? Well, here's what. They sent me a replacement mattress. So let's start this whole thing all over again. All right, so now I'm going to unbag it and let it inflate after I cut the plastic. And we're gonna start from scratch. Now that we have the plastic off, it is expanding. Remember from last time, it takes almost a day to fully expand from its vacuum state, but here it is, the Purple 3 Hybrid Premier Mattress. And that brings us to our one year mark. Or should I say our second six month mark, because that's more appropriate. So what do I think of it? Well, you know what? I love it. My back feels great. My neck feels great. I sleep comfortably. I love the mattress. So what's different? Well, one, I took off a few of those quarantine pounds. Two, I rotate the mattress. It was recommended by someone and I thought, man, that's a great idea. I sure wish Purple would have recommended that to me. Rotate every month just so the mattress is in a different position and that helps. So listen to this. So I referenced earlier about the sheets and I didn't really like the purple sheets. And the reason I don't like it is because I don't like the material. It's that jersey shirt or, or jersey material. I just don't care for it. You may like it. I just wanted you to know why. Guess what? My one year with the purple mattress is over. I'm done. We had some ups. We had some downs. But you know what? It ended up being successful. That leaves me open to review another mattress. Now, don't get me wrong. I'm going to keep this one. But if you had a mattress that you're thinking, man, I would really like to know about this, let me know down in the comment section below. I may look into it. This is Jeff with Jeff Reviews for You. As always, thanks for stopping by, and I hope you have a great day. Just in case you've ever wondered what's inside the purple mattress, remember this is the three, so it's a three inch purple grid. It is pretty sweet stuff. And since I got rid of one of my mattresses, I kept the purple stuff and I actually use this as a seat cushion. Of course I cover it up, but in that sweet, this is what the purple grid looks like. I really do appreciate that you stayed around for my entire one year review of the purple hybrid premier three mattress. You know what? During this video, I took bits and pieces of my earlier videos throughout the year, but you know what? I didn't. I left some of it out. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to link all the videos that I've worked on this year on the purple mattress right around here, and you can click any of them. And by the magic of the internet, when you click one of these links, I'm going to join you at that review. So go ahead, click one. They're safe. I promise.